The soulmates are people who feel a deep or natural connection to one another. The relationship does not have to be physical and may involve a range of methods. For example, similarity, love, platonic relationships, comfort, intimacy, sexuality, sexual activity, compatibility and trust. The term typically refers to a romantic or platonic relationship having implications of a lifelong bond. The strongest bond achievable between a man and a woman. When meeting, whether spiritually or physically, the two feel complete when finding the soulmate. The soulmates are separated. The usual perception is that the divided souls are to one day reunite. According to claims from the Theosophy of Esoteric Religious Movement, which Edgar Cayce altered. According to that work, God initially created uniformly male and female souls. Later opinions submit that souls were split into separate genders due to bad karma with their actions on earth or complete disconnection from God. Many reincarnations take place, where eventually each half seeks the other. When all karmic debt is purified, the two will fuse back together and return to the ultimate. Similar to Dumamu in Doctor Strange, The tarot card meaning, the concept loosely indicated, a person with whom souls bind by consensual intercourse, they must come willingly. In divination, it is believed that two people share an acquired fate once they have intimate relations. The soul mate is recorded as a later theme, but it is not. It was Zeus who divided the soul. And in a similar fashion, Marduk split the mother goddess asunder in two, and the angel of death divides the body. Plato translated the Hebrew scripture from Plato the Symposium. In Greek mythology, mankind was originally created with four arms, four legs, and a head with two faces. Zeus is the god of fear, but totally out of context. Fearing their power, Zeus split them into two different parts condemning them to spend their lives in search of their other half. The people of Earth were split asunder. Here, it is not because of bad karma, but because we stormed Mount Olympus. The actions of Zeus in this narrative are due to fearing mankind. When looking a little deeper, one will find that Zeus, Jove, Eros, and Cupid, among others, are one in the same. The Angel of Death who divides the body. And this is indeed consistent with that of Mesopotamia and ancient Egyptian. Icon form division of the body, I conform death.
in relation to Cupid's bow. What does it mean? Cupid is a cherub, and the bow is lip-shaped for a reason. It is a facial feature. The common phrase in literature is often used to relate to speech, and therefore the mouth. The king, the prophet, the messenger, the voice, you know who, Mamu is the word. If a number of reincarnations must take place, then what does this say about the order of Melchizedek, Saint Michael, the Angel of the Lord, the reincarnating priest? Melchizedek, Saint Michael, the Angel of the Lord, is the first figure in the Bible to be called a priest. The original meaning of priest is a mallet used to kill fish when caught angling. So the fish symbol on the rock is the symbol of death, leading to a line from another reincarnating god. Come after me and I will make you a fisher of men. Tahut, the house of the net. Of course, there is also Loki and his fishing net, which puts the Nuch in Hanukkah. Everything is connected. Before I forget, Anina, Anina, please hit that bell, share, like, comment, and subscribe for more ancient mysteries.